hi everyone and welcome in the previous video we have created few shots regarding electro crop panel esp32 4.2 inch e-paper hmi display okay and if you want to purchase the e-paper hmi display then you can navigate to this link and you can purchase the crow panel esp32 4.2 inch e-paper hmi display i have already this display with me here you can see on the camera it is up and running fine okay now in this video what we are going to do is we are going to run the wi-fi http open weather demo in our esp32 e-paper hmi display so how you can run the same demo for your ct so that thing we are going to cover in this video i have run the demo for my city surat okay you can also run the same demo for your city and you can get your weather details on this screen okay so let's see how you can do that so first of all you can download the arduino code for demo and arduino code for example okay from this link i have already downloaded and here it is on my desktop now we will navigate to the demos folder and in the demos folder you will have the second folder wi-fi http open weather so this is the one which we are going to work on so we will open this arduino file okay so once you open this ino file we have to change few things in this code so first of all you have to change your wi-fi ssid and password details according to your home wi-fi network okay then after you have to change your open weather map api key now you have to create the account in the open weather map okay and then after you can get this key so i have already created an account on the open weather map okay and up you can find the api key so once you create the account you can click on your account name and you can click on my api keys okay so i am going to open that in the new tab and here you can see here is our open weather map api key which you can copy okay and which you can paste in your code now the next two things we have to change is the city and the country code okay so if you have searched for your city here in the open weather map dot org so here i have searched for city ahmedabad okay so here you can see the details for ahmedabad city now once you search for any city here you can see the code one two seven nine two three three so this is the code which you have to copy okay so which that is the code which i have copied and i have pasted here so previously i have done this for the surat city okay now we are going to do that for the ahmedabad city so in the code you have to provide the name of your city which is ahmedabad okay and after that you have to provide this code one two seven nine two three three okay one two seven nine two three three and then you can upload this code to your esp32 e-paper hmi display but before uploading you have to make some changes in the uploading format or you can say some parameter changes so that you can find on the wiki page so you can directly go to this wiki page from here or i have already opened that wiki page so first thing you have to change is the board so you have to select the board esp32 s3 development module okay which i have already selected here the next thing you have to select is the flash size so that is 8 mb and in the bracket it is 64 mb so let's check the flash size so yeah 8 mb 64 mb so we have changed it to the required okay then after we have to change partition scheme to huge app 3 mb okay so i'm going to change the partition scheme now huge app 3 mb okay and then after you have to change psram to opi psram so again tools psram to opi psram okay after changing these things you can compile your code okay so we have successfully compiled the code but i have forget to explain you one thing 
that if you get any error for library then you have to install this arduino json library okay so you can copy the name from here you can go to the library section and here you can search for arduino json and you have to download this first library arduino json by arduino and the version i have installed is 0.2.0 .0. okay then only this code is going to be compiled because epd.h is already available here epd.gui.h is already available here and pic.h is again available here but the arduino json library which you have to install okay and maybe this two library is already installed in your system so you don't have to worry about it okay so once you have compiled the code what you can do is you can just upload the code to your esp32 epaper hmi display okay so let me open these two things parallelly okay so code is successfully uploaded here you can see the http response from the open weather and here you can see the detail that weather is smoky weather temperature humidity sea level wind speed and the city okay and the same thing is available here now the Ahmedabad city the name is very big so that's why d is coming here okay otherwise you can see the humidity 56 okay which we got from the api now wind speed 1.54 meter per second temperature 22.02 .02, okay the visibility 1017 which is the sea level okay and the mist or you can say the smoky weather now you will get the same detail on the open weather as well so here you can see smoky weather okay 22 degree centigrade here you can see 22 degree centigrade and uh, yeah the wind speed is 1.5 meter per second humidity 56 okay now if you want to change this for any other city suppose i want to change it back to my surat city then i can search for surat city okay surat india and uh, what i can do is i can update the code so my city is surat s-u-r-a-t now if you want to change your city then you have to change the country code as well so for Ahmedabad this was the country code but for the surat this is the country code so i am going to paste that country code here now i am going to upload it to this epaper hmi display okay here you can see this is the detail for surat city okay the humidity is more than Ahmedabad wind speed is also more than Ahmedabad okay temperature and the visibility okay so this is how you can create your open weather dashboard for ESP32 ePaper display from Electro okay now the update interval for this display is set to one hour in this code okay so if you scroll down here and if you go to the wide loop section then here you can see the delay so main loop delay is set for one hour now if you want to change it for 5000 millisecond or you can say five second then you can change it to 5000 and then i can upload the code into our epaper display so this screen will update at interval of five second okay now let's see let's upload the code and let's see okay here is the new detail after five second it will again ask to api about the new data and then it will update the display and again after five second it will again ask the data to open with the api and then again after five seconds it will update the display okay so this will be the continuous process okay so that's why they have provided the delay for one hour okay and we can again uh, revert back the program and we can update the program to the esp32 epaper hmi display okay now our open weather dashboard will update at interval of one hour okay so i hope everything is clear and here i have provided every link okay this is the link for the demo this is the link for the example 
this is the wiki page link and this is the purchase link i will also add the open weather api link here so you can directly navigate to this website you can create your account and you can use the api key for your project okay so stay tuned for the future videos regarding ePaper esp32 hmi display from electro till then take care goodbye and thank you